Hello viewers, this is IT System Admin, a complete troubleshooting solution for you. Today, in this tutorial, I am going to show you how to fix system service exception error in Windows 10, another blue screen update. Sometimes it becomes very important for you, so don't forget to watch full video. System service exception is one of Windows BSOD errors along with many other ones such as DPC watchdog violation, bad pool header or system thread exception not handled. Most BSOD are very annoying because your computer will suddenly restart which makes everything unsafe to be gone. This BSOD error often occurs in Windows 10, but it can be found in Windows 11, Windows 7, Windows 8, or Windows 8.1. This type of BSOD could occur on your Windows computer because of several causes, including virus, malware, or other malicious program, corrupted Windows system files, damaged, outdated or incompatible Windows drivers, buggy Windows updates, and many more. Now I am going to show you how to fix these issues. The first solution is just restart the PC. Most of the cases after restarting the PC, the problem has been solved. If your problem is not solved or still persists, you have to Update your computer, check for update, click on a start menu, click on settings, and then click on update and security. Now click on check for update, and it will check for Windows updates and install the latest update. Just close the settings window. If your problem started after any update because of any buggy update, you have to uninstall that update. In search, type control panel. Now click control panel to open it. Now click on uninstall a program. Now click on view install update. You have to see the update installation date and you have to memorize the date from which your PC making this error system service exception error. Okay, now click on update, latest update, and uh, click on uninstall to so, uh, uninstall the buggy update. Okay, now close it. Now you have to check your outdated drivers may be the cause for system service exception error. Now right click on that menu, click on device manager. Now check all drivers here and if you find any notification of any driver just Update it. Check all drivers. Okay. Here, all of my drivers are okay. So there is no outdated driver here. If you find any driver that is showing a notification bar, your notification bar, just right click on it and click on update driver. And then search automatically for driver. And the best driver for your device is already installed. Okay, close it. If this solve your problem, that's okay. If your problem is still persists, you just 
right click on faulty driver and click on uninstall device then just close device manager and then restart your computer after restarting your computer hope your problem will be solved if your problem is still persist or if you do not have access to your computer so now the point is how to solve this issue just connect your usb bootable drive to your computer and then restart your computer now boot your computer from usb flash drive in language section just click on next now you will find a link that is repair your computer just click on repair your computer now you will get three options one continue then troubleshoot and then turn off your pc just click on troubleshoot now click on command prompt command prompt has been opened now in command prompt type sfc space slash scan now now this process will scan all your system files and it will recover the corrupted system files now just hit enter verification process has been started verification 100 percent complete Windows resource protection did not find any integrity violation. Okay, now close command prompt. Now click on continue. And this process will restart your computer. Hope your problem has been solved right now. Now I am logging to my computer. look the system service exception error has been fixed right now in windows 10 windows 8 windows 11 or windows 7 computer this is all for today hope this tutorial is helpful for you keep watching for next tutorial thank you very much